Well, let's start at the very beginning. I was raised in Davenport, Iowa. I'm the youngest of five children with four older brothers and a fabulously supportive set of parents who didn't have the opportunity to go to college, but certainly told us we could do anything we wanted to as long as we were willing to work really hard at it. And I'll tell you that I had a totally gut level reaction to Illinois Wesleyan University when I stepped on that campus and somehow I knew I could succeed there. I didn't even know what a liberal arts college was at that point, and I didn't know that the way I was studying piano might be different from what my peers at Juilliard and other places were doing, but I'm quite confident that it's that background that really formed me and allows me to do much of what I do today. Whitman offers this fabulous opportunity to join a community that is already well established and has a wonderful history and in fact a pretty amazing presence. It's got a exceptional faculty, students who are engaged and curious and who persist to graduation at a very high rate, uh, very skilled staff, a dynamic and passionate board of trustees, and a, a budget that's been very well managed and has led to very low debt compared to our peer institutions. That's a fabulous place to start. But there's also work to be done, and I'm not interested in coming to a place where I'm just a caretaker. I, I want to do that work with the Whitman community. When I arrive at Whitman, I need to get to know this community. And so I anticipate spending a lot of time listening, visiting with people, uh, just being on the campus and starting to understand the Whitman community. We also need to move quickly into a strategic planning process. There's an opportunity with this process to define what really distinguishes this college from all of its peers across the country. And for me, that's really exciting work to be done. As many people know, Whitman used a different process to search for our president this time. Kathy stood out as really the person that best fit what Whitman needs today and could bring to us the skills that were most likely to make the college continue to achieve what we hope for for the institution. Her energy and enthusiasm for the liberal arts comes through from the moment you meet her. She has a passion for the liberal arts, passion for the education of our students, and a passion for the type of place that Whitman College is. There's just great opportunity here to put Whitman in a leadership position amongst the liberal arts colleges in this country. We had said we wanted someone who was articulate, who was passionate about the liberal arts, who had a liberal arts background, who was firm and articulate about her decision making, yet transparent and collaborative in her leadership style. And I think that her style of leadership will mesh well with what our faculty and staff and students are looking for. And I think her, as a trained pianist herself, knows the value of sort of doing what you like, but also having the additional skills of communicating and writing and relating well to others in a way that makes us better citizens. And I think Kathy can articulate that, not only to the body who believes in Whitman and their mission, but also to people who could potentially be part of the Whitman family.